Hi, this is Mitch Watt with Riviera Financial Mortgage in Beverly Hills. Another day in the mortgage business. I want to let you know that I really appreciate you letting me assist you in getting the best mortgage financing for your home purchase or refinance. Also want to let you know that I keep an eye on the market and developments, and I'm always trying to keep you in front position so that you're ready to take advantage of any opportunity or have the best solutions to any problems that might arise. So with that in mind, I put this little informational message together. Please just take a moment to watch it. Let me know what you think, and let me know if you have any questions that I can help you with. Thank you so much. You may be thinking that the best way to buy a home in the current market is to build one, and it certainly seems that the only way to help a housing shortage is to build more homes. It's no surprise that the housing market is tight right now. In fact, according to the National Association of Realtors, the number of existing home sales fell in May of 2021 by 0.9% compared to May in 2020, while the median home price is up year over year by 23.6%. There are several factors contributing to the housing shortage, and one of the biggest problems for new construction is simply that home builders cannot build new homes fast enough. Pandemic combined with supply chain issues and rising material has slowed the rate of construction. Let's look at some of the issues causing the current shortage, beginning with the cost of materials. One of the major issues that home builders are facing is the cost of lumber. In May of 2021, the price of lumber reached an all-time high of almost $1,700, according to Trading Economics. Pre-pandemic lumber prices were commonly around 450 per thousand board feet. Prices have come down since that peak to the relief of the industry. As of July 20th, 2021, the price of lumber was $540.85 per thousand board feet, according to Trading Economics reports. Still, the high cost of materials hasn't been resolved, and other common building materials like oriented strand brain are seeing price surges. In addition to rising costs of material, there is also a shortage of construction labor. In many cases, home builders have simply had to slow their timelines and cut down on how many deals they make at a time to avoid a glut of incomplete homes that cannot be completed because of a shortage of workers. You may be hoping to avoid the challenge of buying a home by simply purchasing a plot of vacant land and building a custom home. You may certainly avoid the competition among home buyers for existing or new homes, but unfortunately, you won't be able to avoid the construction-related problems that can draw out the process and drive up the total cost. We are starting to see some material costs go down and are hopeful that the labor shortage will diminish and people will go back to work. So, where we are right now with new construction is hopefully going to settle down. The real question many are asking, is new construction the long-term solution to our housing shortage? There are positive outlooks for home construction, and in many ways, it's simply a matter of allowing enough time for the construction industry to recover from recent setbacks and adapt to new ones to be able to ramp up building again. There's some catch up to be expected before demand for housing will ease, and we are starting to see some great news for new construction on the horizon. In July of 2021, there were over 1.6 million building permits for privately owned housing units that were approved for construction throughout the U.S. This is according to the U.S. Census Bureau. This is a 6% increase over June of 2021. While it takes time for these permits to turn into move-in ready homes, it is a sign of hope for the future. If you think that new construction is a good option for you, be sure to contact a licensed mortgage professional when you get ready to secure your financing. 
While builders may offer some incentives for using their lender, you want to be sure that you are getting the best program to fit you and your family needs. Thanks for watching and if there's anything we can do to help you with your home financing goals, please don't hesitate to call. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you found it helpful and I hope you would like to discuss it further. So if you would, please feel free to call me, Mitch Millat, Riviera Financial Mortgage, 424-290-8294. You can also email me, Mitch at rivierafinancial.com. You can also find me on Instagram at Mitchell Millat or on my Facebook homepage, Mitch Millat, Riviera Financial, Beverly Hills. Thank you so much. Look forward to talking to you soon and wishing you much, much success in the future.